What up, Yami Killers? This is my review of the Hometown Hero Angel's Breath Frozen Watermelon Review. <clears throat> it is a 9 milligram, 70 VG, 30 PG, 60 mil bottle, which I paid for, I paid around 16 or 18 dollars for. You can catch them on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. And they also have a website that's hometownhero.com. They donate 5%, I believe it is, to veterans. Um, don't quote me on that. This vape mod, I don't know. I don't remember exactly what it is, but this is a baby beast tank with a too cute two coil inside. Which it ranges from I don't know if you can see it there. Ranges from 50, 55 to 65 watts is at best, and 40 to 80 is what it can go to. Wouldn't recommend it because that could ruin your coil at the higher ranges. I don't know if I can get a. There we go. Um. So, one and foremost, I am a candy flavored, fruity flavored vape smoker. I do not do the custards. I do not. I haven't really tried. I tried Mother's Milk. It's all right. Um, but, yeah, so I've tried this already, but here's another impression. It's getting better. Like I, I did a few takes earlier and um, the first couple takes I was getting a lot of juice in my mouth but now it's calmed down. It is, it's an all right flavor. Probably on a scale of one to 10 I'd give it a seven. Um, maybe if I had a ceramic coil set up it would maybe taste better. But um, the taste does get eventually better as you break in the coil, that's why I do it at such a low range. A wattage from 38 to, thir I have it at 38.8, and if I smoke it at 50, it gives it a funny, weird taste. Can't explain it, but it's kind of like a, I don't know, you can't really taste the flavor, you know? So I do a low wattage, break it in for a few puffs, well, for about... I puff on maybe for an hour. And then uh, the flavor gets better and I crank it up to about 50, 55. So, um, this this has helped me a lot. I, I used to smoke every day, about a pack and a half a day. Now I'm down to just the vape for three weeks now. I have quit before in the past. I, I smoked for... I don't know how long, but um, I quit for four months, started back up, and now I quit again. The reason why I quit this time is because I did a pinky swear with my daughter that I never smoked again. So, she said I could still use the vape, and here I am. I'm using the vape. And plus, this would be a boring video if it was a review of cigarettes. I mean, there ain't too many different flavors, but with... Uh, Vape juice, there it is. Uh, so, I'll come back at you in a little bit. If I forgot anything, let me know in the comments. Um, maybe to improve my channel, give me some criticism. But I'll be back once the uh, coil has broken in, and I'll give you another review for the taste. Hello, I am back. I'm back once again. Um, yeah, the coil's broken in now. It's a, it was a brand new coil. Um, so I've been popping on for a while. I changed the wattage to 51.7. There you go. You can see my pups there. Pups is 39,932. See? Um, 
but that's what just just this bait. <clears throat> so I'm gonna try it out again. Tastes really good. It's tasting a lot better now. Um, still, I'd give it a seven. But there's just the right amount of of the mint and watermelon. It tastes pretty good. So I'd I'd recommend buying it. But will I buy it again? Probably not because of the price. I believe I said it was $16 to eighteen dollars. I think I paid now that I remember, I think it was somewhere from twenty two to twenty four. <clears throat> and this is, I don't know, maybe this is like your top shelf kind of vape juice, but um, didn't really research too much on Google looking for uh, different prices. I just bought some, but um, <clears throat> I'm sure if you research, which I probably will do and re research for a lower price because it just it kind of hurts the pocket a little bit. Hey, what's up, Yami Coolers? Um, thanks for watching the video. Hit the like and subscribe button. The Death Nut Challenge will be coming next week. I, me and my friend Jesse, we uh, we did the Death Nut Challenge. So make sure you subscribe to see the video. It's gonna be freaking awesome. Um, not for the kids.